We've been at sea for eight hours and are encountering squall after squall. The big thunderstorms that pass over Florida in the afternoons are coming up from behind us, shifting and increasing the wind, and then dumping rain. Now it's time for a fresh shower. Oh, it's intense. <laughs> yeah, let's head on our the PFDs and go out and film. All right, let's do it. <laughs> I promise, Mom, I'm tethered onto the boat. <laughs> The squalls disappear just as quickly as they engulf Delos, only to leave us in a windless hole. Our wind died with that squall that came through, stole all of our wind, the little that we had. So, yeah, we're just bobbing around, but luckily we're in the current, we're in the Gulf Stream, so we have probably like, I'd say about six knots, seven knots of wind from behind us, and we're doing an average of right around five knots over ground. So we probably got three knots of current and two knots of speed through the water from wind. Five knots, no wind. What do you think about that? <laughs> think about that. <laughs> <laughs> it's called the Gulf Stream. The constant changing conditions means we have to be on our toes and making sure the sails are trimmed properly and prevented so we don't have an accidental jive. Yeah. yeah, we're getting a little oh, yeah. motion on the mizzen here. And yeah, check the preventers on because the wind is changing quite a bit. And we were pretty far over, so we don't want to do an external dive. This is the beauty of offshore sailing. You've lost sight of land, there's no traffic or distractions. You just focus on the conditions of that specific moment. Welcome to our life of adjusting at sea. This is the story of Delos, a sailboat that's been cruising around the world for over a decade. I jumped on board 10 years ago, not knowing that one day I'd be stepping up as captain with my girlfriend and first mate by my side. Over 50 crew have called Delos home, and that tradition of sharing the adventure continues this season as we write the next chapter of the Delos story during a lap around the North Atlantic Ocean. If you enjoy Delos videos, please hit subscribe. It's a fast and free way to keep our journey going. where that white dot is right there. And if we keep going super slow, we're gonna end up getting left behind in this light patch here. So the idea is to, green and yellow. to get up into this green, yellow, and red, and then properly start sailing. So it's not too far, but we just kind of have to keep momentum or else we could get stuck in these light patches and not go anywhere. Right now we're making good speed because we have the, the current with us. Come Once on. we cross the current, mm -hmm. we'll be doing like one or two knots. Yeah, sure. So right now we have a knot of wind behind us, but we're doing good through the current. So I'm just gonna motor at a really low RPM throughout the night and then find the wind. Cool. So it's been a pretty, pretty lucky first day to be honest with you. We are currently going eight and a half knots with four knots of wind occasionally. Yeah, it's really on and off, but we've got the swells behind us and we've also got um, the current pushing us along, so we're doing really well. I'm going to try and catch up with the low. But yeah, it's been an amazing first day of sailing. Ruben, I've came to two conclusions about you. What? One. 
you were like 26 and you lied to us and you have a fake passport. <laughs> and two, you've definitely sailed before and you're like a captain of a vessel because you, you know cooking everything like right away. What? We, no. we tell you one time and you just like pick it up and get it. Oh, <laughs> that's really kind words from Senor Brady. That's so sweet, man. I'm 24, don't tell them. That is a solid first sunrise yeah, for sure. out here. Oftentimes it like comes up behind the clouds and you can't even see it, yeah. but that was full, that was full viz crazy. on the horizon. So pretty. Yeah. And the moon, so cool. You can just take a picture of the moon like that and it's lit so well and then turn on and take a picture of the sunrise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Love it. Madness. Love it. Check it out. We got the moon. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, not bad, bad for handheld and semi low light, huh? Yeah, for sure. And then the sun. You me down. Me down. Look how hectic that yeah, is. That's like a... That is a damn good way to wake up. Nice done. Yes. Increased in their activity, the other half were decreased. Now those genes that were switched off by a lack of sleep were genes associated with your immune system. This is a typical moment in the cockpit of Zelos while on a long passage. If you take away the sweet music and slick editing, it's really just a lot of downtime. The first few days are spent adjusting to the rocking movement of the boat, which tends to put everyone into a very sleepy state, as they adjust their lives to our only sense of time, the watch schedule. Our main responsibility is to keep Delos and her crew safe and happy. This means staying in tune with the wind and weather, ensuring Delos is sound mechanically, cooking for the crew when it's our turn in the galley, keeping crew morale high, and of course, trying to capture all these moments on camera. How about that? How about that? <laughs> these things aside, passage is a time to truly relax, to slip away from any responsibility that doesn't fall into our present world of the boat at sea. To not feel guilty about spending an entire day reading, listening to podcasts, watching films, making music, or simply just doing nothing but stare at the waves. But there is one thing that can get in the way of enjoying this downtime. Little brother, maybe not feel so good. Maybe he makes up the. It's really weird though. We're like over a day in. Normally it happens it's right away. away yeah. But I think because now the world's been doing this for the past few hours. Yeah. 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 Get your hair wet, bro. In the back of your neck. Pretty so mean. It's like if you feel like puking, just let us know because we have to film it. <laughs> and then you grab the camera. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and I was like, okay, I'm just getting ready. <laughs> Maybe your brother's not feeling so I'm good. I'm not feeling so good. <laughs> He's laughing though. Yeah, uh -huh. I feel good in spirit. Just my stomach is like... Ugh. <laughs> it's not in my head, like, I feel like my mind's clear. It's just like my stomach is like... Unbalanced. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
You have to make a plea to Poseidon. That's the first one. Yeah. You have to make some sacrifice or plea. What do I have to sacrifice? Some nipple hairs, maybe? Ah. Oh. That's a good idea. I need to, I need to trim. Do you want me to give you some scissors and you can sacrifice yeah, some nipple Yeah, let's do it. Let's sacrifice some nipple hairs this Poseidon. <laughs> Don't cut them off. Okay. And then we'll keep you trim. Dear Poseidon, thank you for blessing me with this journey. But please, just leave my stomach alone. <laughs> 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 Sometimes we're bound for Liverpool, sometimes we're bound for France But now we're bound to Lurvick Town to give them girls a chance Hurrah, hurrah, for the girls of Dublin Town Hurrah for the bunny green flag and the harp without the crown Yeah. After motoring on and off to keep our speed up, we finally made it to the semi-consistent winds of the North Atlantic High. Burning a bit of diesel has paid off and has put us in the perfect position to head dead downwind and raise our Jenniker, which is basically a light wind version of the Buddha man sail. So Sean, you be on the halyard? Gotcha. You be on the sheet? I'll be up front running it through the, the track. And then Ruben's on filming and Kiara's on working out. Get it! Hi! <laughs> Hi! Okay, you can start pulling up now. Good hold. Both sails up at the same time gives us the option to put the wind directly behind us, and the added speed from more sail area increases the stability. Oh, way less rolly. That's awesome. That's so good, boy. Yeah. Good? I love that sail. Oh, it feels good. We're going fast now. Yeah. It definitely feels now like a bit more stable. stable. Yeah, yeah, definitely. What speed are we on now? Six and a half. Seven. What's for lunch today, bro? I'm gonna make a nice little salad with some nuts and then for yourself, sandwich with some turkey meat and peppers and all that. Yeah, okay. Is that yeah. <laughs> Wait, that is welcome, welcome to your life, brother. <laughs> Doesn't get better than that, you know? Girls filming girls shower. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what about this little virgin 19 year old? Oh. Virgin 19 year old! <laughs> you know nothing! <laughs> you know nothing that I've been through. You know through. nothing about me! You know my name, not my story. What are you working on, bro? I'm working on my figure of eight and my nuts and chilling out. That's the other thing. You're doing your homework? I'm doing my homework. You're learning every day. I'm learning. So proud of every you. Every day is a school day. How about that? How about that? <laughs> like what you're missing outside. <laughs> Slow my. <laughs> there we go.
Uh, and that was filmed. See what the chef has to do with it. Right? Then we come in here and tease you. Look at it, we shot with this little Osmo. Just like this. That's so cool. Don't let our secret out, Luke. Just like this. It's crazy. It's, it's like, what? Three, how much was it? 350 300 bucks? bucks. 300 bucks? That's incredible. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> 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 oh, not quite as good as you, Kia, but no, you... never gonna be as good as Kia. <laughs> well, give it 10 years, he, you know? <laughs> He's just 19. I need a bikini. <laughs> oh, be careful, we will put you in a bikini. No, I should have said it. Be careful. What have I done? <laughs> uh, you, know, I have a bikini for you. you actually? Yeah. Let's try it. Thank <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love him. <laughs> so pretty out here right now. It's been really hot today, but there's kind of this wall coming up alongside of us. And I don't know if the rain's gonna hit us or not, but the cloud cover has, and it's given us some shade and it feels so good. But it's just stunning to look at the clouds and all the little rain pitter pattering down. It's beautiful. We're gonna drop the Jennifer because the wind's picked up quite a bit and we don't want to blow her. So. <laughs> Good job, guys. Yeah. Captain had to take a nap. That didn't last long. No. Good. Like two minutes into a nap. <laughs> that's good. I'm glad we got it down. Yeah. Sure, that's scary when those things back when though, because that's exactly how they burst. Is yeah. when it when the wind comes back around from behind. Yeah. And it just shreds. So we got lucky it didn't. We got it down quick though. That was good. Yeah, we got it down super quick. This thing came out so like. Impressive. Good job, guys. <laughs> High five. Good job, team. team Good job, team. team. Kia was napping too. Sean was napping. Everyone was asleep. We're like, everybody, all hands on deck. And I was like, look, look, look. Hey, okay, guys. Can this? <laughs> <laughs> you think it's funny to stop her, Blue? Yeah. Yeah, we can we can hold this. Let's just hold this course. Okay. So we can, it's okay if we cut this a bit because we're going so fast. We're doing real good. Yeah. Cool. So. See. Good job, guys. Good course. Next up on Delos, at 2 a.m. we get hit by a 45 knot squall. 35. Yo, buddy! And get a little lesson in meteorology. Shape of the cloud is four, ma four meters that way because once all that hot air starts getting pulled off the ocean, that starts going up and then cools condenses comes down. What happened to your clothes, Brady? That's gone. Did you trim up, Brady? Trim up what? That bod, look at that. I don't think so. I'm still 200, new merch. Look at that merch. This is now available in the shop to buy. That's a sweet top. They're awesome, look how soft it is. Sound effects as you film. Yes. Yes. <laughs> That was a lot of fun. That's a wrap. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna drink that. No. Just crazy. No. <laughs> I'm filming you, pee pee. No. Why not? No. I don't know you're filming me. You done? Yeah, sure. Bye, bro. When I'm gonna get it. Hey. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Wait, do I, I just finished eating popcorn. Do I have something in my teeth? Let's see. Nope, just the tongue. Okay. I don't really mind being sick or feeling out. I'm just part of the experience. I'm just grateful to be on the boat, so I don't mind. But yeah, super chill watch. I don't even know if it's my watch anymore. I've kind of lost track. Because I was feeling ill, I've kind of just forgotten. Yeah.